Greetings, knights and knaves, lords and ladies, tis I, your lord commander, and welcome back to more Middle Earth Shadow of War. We are on episode 16 today. After a very, very successful uh, siege battle the other day, which was uh, which was pretty fun. It was actually a <laughs> quite a tough fight once we got to the Overlord. That <laughs> I think that took more time than the uh, the actual siege itself. But nonetheless, we have officially taken uh, the region of Saragoss, and now we have made it to Gorgoroth, one of my uh, actually I would say my second favorite. Uh, map I think just because the environment alone like look at that. <laughs> that's that's cool. Uh, anyway Oh, what is that? Okay, Karagors. I was like, I thought it, I thought he was riding on a giant spider that terrified me for a moment um, But anyway, we are here in Gorgoroth and we are going to uh, Rescue our dear friend Baranor. Baranor was taken by the Uryx, but he is not lost work with Idril to rescue him reward iron guard skill Hmm, okay so yes, uh, we're going to make it uh, all the way across the map. However, we've got quite a few Uruks in the way, uh, including Skun the Dark, who we, we fought at the end of the uh, the siege uh, in part 15. I don't I didn't want to highlight him, sorry. <laughs> um, but yeah, we are on our way, we must hopefully. Before it's too late. He is bait, Talion. And he will live until we arrive. I agree. But they're also not gonna unalive him on my watch. Oh my goodness. Vamos. We go. Oh my god, I got stuck. And somebody sees me. Oh god. Run, Talion, run. Just run, Talion. We don't want this fight. Not yet. Cause a little bit of chaos. What the f- Why did he jump? Man, I love this. Look at the lighting. Oh yeah. We made it to Gorgoroth. Oh, look at the the fortress in the background. Yo, that is cool. Is that the fortress or is that just background? I think it's just background. Yeah, man, that's cool looking though. Oh, look at the Grogs fighting in the back. That's crazy, man. Wild. Anyway, let us jump straight into the story missions now that we've been uh we've been just plowing through these damn uh siege battles and everything uh i think it was it was pretty you know about time that we uh that we go about doing the story missions and everything so uh here we go so much death death would be relief to these men the purpose of this camp is torture. Oh no, not torture. Yeah. <laughs> Look at my armor. Oh, it looked orange for a moment. Anyway. I don't know why we had to come all the way to Logbones with this one. Punish my feet like this. Orders is orders. If he can lead us to more of these pigs, then it's worth it. What? Just get him where you find him, I say. Scary. Okay, they were not scared. And now they don't feel anything. I got two of them. Oh, what the? <laughs> My aim is still really bad. Thanks, bud. Oh. 
Nice. We rescue the Gondorians. Nah, I would never let that happen. To help. Oh, it wouldn't let me do a double. Oh, crap. Got you, bud. We must leave. Die, you miserable demons. Oh, my goodness. Let's go, Gondorian squad. Let's go. Uh, where's the rest of them? One, two, okay. There we go. <laughs> now let me do the double execution. Good stuff. Oh, there's a... There are captains over there. There's another one somewhere. No, I can't rescue Baranor just yet. I haven't rescued all the Gondorians. One more, hold on. There's one more somewhere. Before I jump into this fight, I need to get some more elf shot. Alright, let's go. He's got this one. Where's the ranger? I don't see no ranger around here. Alright, let's check out these captains. Narug the assassin. Vulnerable to execution. Soft-headed. Okay. Damaged by ranged fire and frost. Poison, poison proof, immune to curse, and vigilant against stealth. He has a blood brother. I wonder if... This is his blood brother. Bork. It is not, in fact, his blood brother. Bork the Militant. That's cool. He's a uh, commander type, which is cool. Fear of Brutality. That's gonna... That's gonna be fun. Watch this. Ah, oh, it did nothing. Oh, it did. Usually, we have to bring your kind in chains and under guard, but you just walk in. Don't start thinking you're any different from this bunch. I literally do what I want. Ayo! You used to keep me up at night, but now I can see that you don't know what you're doing. Oh, really? Oh, I didn't get the square in time. 
I didn't realize I executed him. I thought I parried it. This is all in a day's work for me. Oh yeah? I was about to say, isn't he soft-headed? Cool. I think he's, yeah, he's too high a level. That's a shame. The the dark assassin running around uh, Gorgoroth with me. I feel like that'd be really cool. I got him, guys. Don't you worry about it. Very cool. Oh, perfect. Recruit. Oh, and he's a spy. Let's go, you guys. Recruit. Or uh, infiltrate. Make spy. There we go. Hold on. Let's get this other Gondorian first. And then I got you, Baron Orr. Don't even worry about it, bud. Oh, we got two of them. Yeah, get that other one. You got him, right? You got him? Is he going to get him? I don't think he's going to get him. <laughs> Useless. All right, that's fine. Don't worry. I'll be the guy. I don't know why I, like, grabbed at him. Like, hey, you. <laughs> anyway, Baron Orr, my man. I'm so sorry we brought this upon you. He just falls. <laughs> oh, Baron Orr. You're injured. It's nothing. You saved us. Again. You were right. Staying in Mordor is certain doom. But I cannot leave. My lady. Then we will be doomed. Together. Aw. And just like that. Damn. And just like that, the men and women of Minas Etho now flee and, you know, disperse into the, the wilds of Mordor to seek their vengeance. It's really sad. It's kind of bittersweet. You know, we rescued our bestie, but that was also like the end of the the gondorian uh quest line in mordor that kind of sucks you know we'll never see or hear from the gondorians again until uh until the events of lord of the rings actually anyway skill unlocked iron guard activate this skill upgrade to make warriors you summon much stronger press right on the d-pad to summon warriors okay Cool. And there's a hide here over here, which is perfect. So we're going to go ahead and grab this. No. <laughs> Thanks for that. Anyway, now that we got that all situated, uh, the Gondorian quest line is now 100% completed. So what I'm thinking is, instead of just jumping straight into the Balrog missions, I would rather save that for later. Um, that way I can devote like a whole episode to it. Um, I'm not sure how much time has passed. Probably not a whole lot, to be honest. But I think I might just end it here. Uh, today is kind of a busy day for me and I haven't posted anything today yet and it's already like it's already noontime so uh, this might be the end of this episode for today just so I can go and do the things that I need to do outside of home and then hopefully I'll have time later tonight to uh, I'll be able to come back and maybe I'll bulk uh, record a few a few things and who knows maybe I'll, I'll like jump back into For Honor just to throw a little bit of uh, you know a little bit of variety into the the weekly posting but uh for the next episode i think we're gonna jump back to uh nernan that way we can uh start taking care of these eltario missions where did it go there was an eltario mission here 
and it no longer exists. Uh, or no, 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 no. I don't think it was here. I think it was Saragos. It might be Saragost? Don't quote me on that. I actually have no idea. Yeah, it is. Okay, right here. The Chosen. So, for next episode, we're going to return to Saragost so we can start uh, helping Eltariel investigate the Nazgul. And maybe we'll run into the rest of these captains, but... Oh, that's right. The former Overlord. I might just kill him, to be honest, uh, next time we see him, but... Nonetheless, uh, without further ado, always, always, always remember honor and service, glory and sacrifice, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.